All right. By the numbers. My first number for by the numbers is Lem. 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 Because Bryce Young has already been sent. The size of 11 year old. 11 times so far this NFL season. Oh, damn, I thought it was 14. He has been sacked 11 times this NFL season. So the Lions are going to be able to get after Bryce Young. They're going to be able to put some pressure in his face, and they're going to be able to put him on the ground. I, I like that. I like that limb. Uh, my number, 18. The Panthers have, haven't scored over 18 points in any game they've played all season. Mm. This is what when you hear an Amara St. Brown's out. Listen, brother, you're not, you're not stressed to score any more than 18 to beat this team, and then your defense looks good, and you're at home. They haven't scored more than 18 points. I think you should be very supremely confident in this Detroit Lions defense, despite what you saw out of that team last year. Another thing, too, this ain't, the, this ain't last year's Panthers. Steve Wilkes, I thought he should have got the head coaching job. Yeah. And the way they whooped on the Detroit Lions and were kind of vying for a playoff spot there at the end of the year. And you could say they were ass, but like the whole division was. Tom Brady and them ushered into the playoffs with a below 500 record. Chuba Hubbard, I think, is the only guy outside the offensive line really remaining mm-hmm. that, that would have made me nervous. This ain't a Steve Wilkes team. This is a it's Frank not a Wright Steve team. Wilkes team. This is not a Steve Wilkes That's team. That's my by the numbers. By the numbers. This one is a little scary. He's so small. Because you did mention two things that are still there uh-huh. for the Panthers, and that is their offensive line, oh. and that is Chuba Hubbard. Yeah. And last year, against the Detroit Lions, Chuba Hubbard averaged 10.4 yards per carry. And it wasn't a small amount of carries. I believe he had 12 or 14 carries in the game. And he averaged 10.4 yards per carry. We know that that was an embarrassing loss for the Detroit Lions. They got 300-plus rushing yards racked up against them. you got to contain Chuba Hubbard in this game. You have to. Uh, listen, I, I, uh, I've i always been kind of like high on Chuba Hubbard. I've always like found him like fascinating. He hasn't really gotten the respect, that, both from that organization – and like around the league, because I think when he gets the ball, he does things. I don't know why he's always considered like a backup or like a some guy like sleep on. This, this dude balls. Yeah. He, he does get it. I'm, I'm, I'm with you. That That is the one to be wary of. Uh, my next number, 84. Talking about the Detroit Lions defense. Mm-hmm. They've only allowed an 84 quarterback rating all year. By the number. And let's be real about Okay, there's only like two of those guys they played that were in the playoffs last year. Geno Smith, Patrick Mahomes. Still, they've been dominant. And, and, and the Bryce Young. He's having his growing pains. Yeah. He's having his growing pains. I think the Detroit Lions secondary getting a little revamp there from Emmanuel Mosley come back too. I, I like this, man. I like that. I like it. I'm going to stick with the defense here, and I'm going to stick with the run defense. By the numbers. By the numbers. The number is 54. The Detroit Lions have only given up 54 rushing yards before contact so far this year. The league average is is 140.25. So that means the Lions have given up less than half of the league average of rushing yards before contact. That means if you get the ball and you're trying to run it, somebody's going to put a body on you pretty quick if you're playing the Detroit Lions. And you're going to have to keep doing that. you got to gang tackle. you got to get to these guys. you got to put them in the dirt. Mm-hmm. That stat is crazy to me. What's, what's it one more time? They've only given up 54 rushing yards before contact so far this season. The wow. league Bad average numbers. is 140.25. Do you, like, you know how like, you miss up on a, on a group text a little bit? Do you ever, like, scroll up to see, like, what was said? Yeah. Do you see what I threw in there in, uh, late no. night, like 1 a.m.? No. Brother, I, I didn't want to admit this out loud. This is something I'd only put in to a, a, <laughs> a, a friendly a group text. Bro, I was watching that run defense last night, and I was like, bro. I can, oh, yeah, I did see that. I can yeah. masturbate yeah. this. <laughs> It was filthy. Yeah, it was. Everything Spinney just said is so goddamn true. There's plays where, like, even if it was Aaron Jones, I believe it was, from the Packers game, even like he looked like he got, like, a little space, no, nah, next thing you know, John Kaminsky's fucking on his back. That's a six foot five, 200 plus pound man. Just, like, you want to hear another number? What? About the Lions' defense and the rush defense? Lay it on. By the numbers. By the numbers. 60.8. The Lions are only allowing 60.8 rushing yards per game so far this pretty season. Pretty close to 69. It's pretty, it's... Can masturbate to that, too. Yeah, it's By the like 8.2 away. By the numbers. 60, not even 61 yards rushing per game. It's nasty. Yeah, that is nasty, dude. That we is haven't nasty. seen that since the Nanama Kitsu era. Shout out, AG, defending Glenn. Make sure you guys send your apology forms. I'm going to stay keeping the 60s for my by the numbers. By the numbers. Number 65. 
You talk about the run game, Detroit Lions shutting that down. Are we concerned about the pass game? Not so much. Bryce Young on the year in only four games or three game sample for him. Only 65% completion percentage on the year. The Detroit versus Detroit Lions defense is only allowed an 84 QB rating. Emmanuel Mosley coming back mm -hmm. by the numbers. Favorable things for Detroit Lions. I know it's any given Sunday, but favorable things. Detroit Lions, the secondary, I, I could see them getting down and dirty on Bryce Young. I'll piggyback with this one on you. By the numbers. Bryce Young is only averaging 167.7 yards Ooh, that was one of my, per game. That was a lot. Yeah. Not even 170 yards passing per game. The Lions are going to eat, boy. So you got a little baby say. Bryce Young. Another one. By the numbers. I'm a Rob Gab. Yeah, you, you take the day off. We, we, we might not need you. Just get, go get right. Three and two. Bryce Young so far this season the has age of your three last fumbles. <laughs> hey, I like, I like him older. Bryce Young this season has three fumbles and two interceptions. Baby hands Bryce Young. Little baby boy 5'3 Bryce Young has been getting thrown around. Against Aiden oh. Hutchinson. Just imagine those heavies coming after you. Yeah. Aiden Hutchinson, Isaiah Bugs. Boys for the eat. Both of them Quaras. It's Jack Campbell coming off the edge. Derek Barnes coming off the edge. Little baby boy Bryce Young is going to get thrown around. By the numbers. Uh, the Carolina Panthers. They're averaging 95 yards rushing on the year. That's more than 68, right? But only ranks 22nd in the league. It's, that's, that, those aren't good numbers to go by. Mm -hmm. Those aren't the greatest numbers right. to, to head into Ford Field against the best run defense to date in the NFL in the 2003 season, I should say. However, we have a new guy in the, in the room. He wants to play along. Nicholas Koloff. Would you like to tap in? Uh, by the numbers. By the numbers. 136. <laughs> 0.25 yards per game allowed by Carolina and 136.5 rushing yards per game by the Lions. So 136 yards, Detroit Lions run for a game, and Carolina gives that up per game. Oh. We're going to run for oh. at least 136 yards. Oh, it's going to be game over on the ground in Ford Field. Detroit man. Lions for your own the run game. By the numbers. By the numbers. That's a nice one. That, that was a nice one. That fit that perfectly on that one. Let's by go. By the numbers. I got another n couple numbers on this by one. We know that was an embarrassing loss for Detroit in Carolina last year. Yes. But by the numbers. Cheeks. Jared Goff had 355 yards, three touchdowns, and no interceptions in that game. Did he really? He did. 355 yards? 355 yards. Oh, yeah, they had a little comeback. Three I had to turn touchdowns off, I had to turn and that zero off. interceptions by the numbers. Jared Goff was balling in that game, even though it was in a loss. Guys, we talked a little bit about it earlier. If I'm going to say Browns out, who, who thinks going to step up? By the numbers. I picked a certain person, and that was Sam Laporta, because on average, Carolina's been giving up 44 yards to tight ends. And Sam Laporta, that's an easy average for him. He's going to eat. Against the Carolina Panthers, and not just if, if Amara's gone, but also because you have a, a Jamison Williams back in the game, mm -hmm. a guy that's going to have to catch the attention of a safety who's not going to be able to step down to try to tr again quote intensify, capitalize, whatever on try emphasis on try, I should say, because Sam Laporte is breaking tackles like crazy too. I think Sam Laporte is going to eat in this game by the numbers, by the by numbers, the by the numbers, five. The Carolina Panthers have only <laughs> scored five offensive touchdowns so far this year. Or Booker T. By, by, by the by numbers. Down. I like the Lions' chances on defense. I, I'm, I'm, again, I don't mean to sound arrogant. I know they got their ass whooped last year, but this ain't that team, and this ain't that Detroit Lions. By the numbers, I'm, I'm with you. How about this one for by the numbers? And we actually made it all the way to the break this time. Shout out to us. Zero. You're welcome. None. Not a no wins for this Carolina Panthers game. Mm -hmm. For the Carolina Panthers team. Chris, you got a number? Bears. I do have a number, and it's actually Hideous. going off of it's actually going off of easies, and it's zero. Zero is gonna be the number of fourth down Dan Campbell's gonna have to call this game. Because it's gonna be a blowout. Ain't, no, ain't, ain't gonna be no fourth down conversions. You don't Chris need that. Jinxing my team. Need that. Doesn't matter if you have Why one you ass cheek and three toes, I will beat your ass. He hey. will beat your ass. I, I love it. I love it. That was by the number.